Zawi. 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 Shoo, bird. Oh, shoo yourself, you big hairy lug. What in Charles name it? I know you. You arrived with that Stark girl yesterday. You're her bird. Her bird? I am my own bird, I'll have you know. Her bird. Pfft, the nerve of some people. Besides, I lost her. She done gone vanished on me. I am, it seems, an expert at misplacing beautiful young women. She's not misplaced. She's with... The Resistance. The Resistance. So she did find the rebels. And she didn't think to tell me. Well, some friend she turned out to be. Well, to be fair to the girl, it wasn't entirely... Uh, uh, voluntary. What do you mean? They kidnapped her. Crow to the rescue! Uh, so, where exactly did they kidnap her to? I'm not supposed to... Well, I reckon the chances of you being an Azadi spy are rather remote. And that poor girl could probably use a friend. Do you know the old Sentinel Library outside the city? It's in ruins now, but beneath it, in the Enclave, you'll find your girl. Unless they took her egg, in which case... Hold on, Zoe! Hold on to your head! I'm on my way! Ulvik the... the ever-thirsty. Aye, that's me. What can I help you with, Da? A bit too early in the day for a drink, is it not? <laughs> We're taking you in for questioning in relation to Azadi property that was stolen in your establishment the other evening. Oh. Well, I'm afraid I know nothing about that, Da. Good. Then this should be quick. Please come with us, Mr. Uh, ever-thirsty. And what about my tavern? My customers? It's the reaping. People expect the taps to be open and the beer to be flowing. I... They're going to have to visit some other establishment tonight. I trust you got some sleep last night? I would have, if you guys believed in bedsheets and pillows. You are fortunate to be alive, girl. Who are you? Why do you ask questions about the Resistance? I'll keep it simple. Or maybe it's better to mention the Rebels. On the other hand, asking for the Rebels is what got me into trouble and... In I'll keep it... S I'm Zoe. I need your help. Our help? With what? I didn't know who else to ask. I need to get to the Purple Mountains. I don't know where that is. What about the Ular? I'm sorry. Abnaxus? Of the Venar? I have heard of the Venar, but they left the Northlands. And Abnaxus? Maybe a whisper? Long ago? Nothing more. I cannot help you. Oh, damn. Is there anyone here who would know? Perhaps. But you haven't answered my question, girl. Why should we help you? For all I know, you're an agent of the Azadi. No, I'm... Zoe! She's Zoe! Balance. Don't you dare touch her head. She's on an important mission! I see. And who are you? Crow! Honorary rebel, long-term avian buddy, and occasional sidekick of April Ryan. Rebel leader, adventurer, hero, savior of the balance. 
That's right. Here's Crow. This is him. I'm me. So... Where's April? She can vouch for Zoe. They're best friends, tight as two chicks in a nest. I don't see April. Is she out on a mission or sleeping in or... Why are you both looking at me like that? I... I thought you knew. Knew what? What's going on? What? April Ryan is dead, Bird. She was assassinated during an Azadi raid on Miria the winter before last. She died a hero's death and was given a hero's burial. We remember her fondly. What? I'm so, so sorry. Crow! Crow! Okay, I'm an idiot. I've heard of this bird. Crow. So, you knew April Ryan? We met a couple of times. I... I was there when she died. I found her. I tried to save her, but... I couldn't. So, yeah, I guess I knew April. You're the Stark girl. The one who dreams. They spoke of you. Bakim, Bryn, Chuan. They said you were one of us. Oh, this certainly changes things. But how did you... He's gone. Of course he's gone. I should have seen that coming. It's not like he could just let Kian go without... Ugh, he's such a... Oh. Oh. Hey. Uh, your hair. It's so pretty. Thanks. Who's gone, Enu? What? Oh, oh, Ligo. He vanished in the middle of the night, chasing Kian, of course. Idiots, the both of them. Maybe this is for the best. If Liko can help Kian... Kian? Big Azadi guy. People call him the Apostle. You know him? We met once, briefly. He was kind to me. But isn't he the enemy? Was. He's with us now. Defected. Uh, yep. Well, except that he abandoned us again to go on a crazy suicide mission He to... left last night. <sighs> of course. After everything that's happened, we just miss each other. Uh, oh, Enu, this is... Zoe. Am I saying that correctly? Yeah. Hi. Nice to meet you, Enu. You're so pretty. Uh, that came out wrong. Wanna be friends? Oh, sorry. Zoe needs our help. She has questions. Maybe you of can... Of course! No problem. Leave this to me, Shepard. I'm sorry for questioning you, Zoe. And I'm sorry I could not be of any assistance. Please, stay. Speak with Enu and the others. Perhaps someone here has the answers you're looking for. Thank you, Shepard. Where are you from? Your clothes are amazing. Where did you get them? They came with the jump. I'm from Stark. That's... Across the divide. On the flip side of the balance. The world of science. Are you serious? That's incredible. I have so many questions. I don't even know where to start. I... I'm... I am seriously worried my head might explode. I think I need to sit down. Oh, don't explode. I'm not that special. I mean, you're orange and the ears... Uh, I'm just a boring old zid. It's totally normal. Holy crap, Stark. I can't believe it. How did you get here? Are you a... are you a shifter? A dreamer. I just... dream myself here. Just dream yourself here. That's it. No biggie. You are the best thing I have ever seen. Seriously. <laughs> really? Okay. Thank you. So, what do you need help with? Shepard said... I'm trying to find the Purple Mountains. And a tribe of magical creatures called the Ula, someone, a Venar named Abnaxus, told me Whoa, to... Oh, slow down. Okay. Purple Mountains, Ular, Venar, Epnaxis, right? Nope. None of that sounds remotely familiar. I have never heard any of those words before. Of course, there are a lot of things I don't know. I'm a... I mean, I was a farm girl. A silly zibling. There's so much I don't know. But I do know where to look for answers. Oh? Where? The library. The library holds all the answers. Do you have libraries in Stark? Never mind, silly question. Of course you don't. I'll go to our library right now and start looking. Purple Mountains, Ular, Abnaxis of the Venar. Come find me when you're ready. I can't wait to spend more time with you. Ugh, oh, sorry.
They add color to the place, if nothing else. They look ready to go to war. I hope they won't have to. I'm so, so sorry, Crow. I thought you knew. It's fine. It's not your fault. I just can't... I can't believe she's gone. But I sort of knew, you know. I felt it in my heart. And that final time we were together, it wasn't... It wasn't like it used to be. It was weird. Like too much time had passed and we drifted apart. I should have known it wouldn't last. He's not alone in feeling that. How can you ever know something like that? I know that feeling. It's something you just have to learn to live with. I know. I will. Were you there when she... I witnessed the whole thing. Perhaps better to avoid the topic and I would... I was there. I saw it happen. I tried to help her, to save her. I know I was supposed to, but I... couldn't. Not your fault. Bad things happen. People die. Life goes on. Anyway. Did I help with, you know, the rebel thing? Did they believe you? That you're not a spy? You did. They do. It's fine now. They'll help us. Good. 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 They're not gonna cut your head off? What? No. Good. Good. I wish I could have been more helpful. But it was ten years ago. And I didn't really pay attention to what April said about that Abnaxis chap. It's okay. If you don't mind, I need to be alone for a little while. Clean my feathers, sharpen my beak, reflect on the nature of life. Bird stuff. Totally understand. I'll find you in the city. Shepard, leader of the rebels. I wouldn't want to get on her bad side. She scares me a bit. What's he doing? He looks nervous. Should I interfere or wait until he's done? That's the guy who put a bag over. What's he doing? That's the guy who put a bag over my head. Oh, I, I didn't, I didn't see you there. Hey, are you supposed to be hunting your own? He looks guilty. This doesn't look right. He look... Is this your room? Well, we don't... You know, we don't have our own rooms. Anyway, Keen's gone. I was just looking for... Um... It's Zoe, is it not? I'm Jakai, Ben Rima Salman's nephew. She said some very nice things about you. You'll have to give her my regards. How is Ben Rime? I noticed the journeyman was closed down. Yeah, she's in Coldstone. They arrested her for colluding with the Resistance. She was sentenced to ten years in the dungeons. I don't know if she'll survive that. Anyway, I'm sure she'll be happy to hear that you're back in town. I'm sorry about your aunt. Yes. Thank you. I don't know what I'll do without her. She's the only family I have. I'm... Look, I have to go into town on an errand now, but please, let me know if there's anything I can do for you. They kept me locked up in one of those cells all night. This may not be a prison, but it's not far from it. The library's in the back, if you're looking for anyone. Feel free to wander around up here. 
but downstairs is off limits. I miss my tiny apartment now. There are fewer rebels than I thought. Having seen what they're up against, I'm worried. So many books. Which makes sense, given that this used to be a library. I hope Enu finds a clue in one of these books. Red Naxus, Purple Mountains, Ula, 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 Ula. Nope, nothing, no. I have to resist this intense desire to stroke her yellow fur. I don't uh, think that'd be look, kosher. Please don't fail me now. I've been trying to find a book, or a scroll, or a manuscript, or a map, or a torn note page, or ancient magical tome, or a pamphlet, or a piece of cloth that mentions the Purple Mountains, or the Ular, but... No luck. It's really frustrating. This library has never let me down before. Bad library! There must be something here. She seems so curious about me. This is where I try to connect and make... You just joined the Resistance? Oh, yes. Uh, no. Not really just. About a half a year ago? Wait, more than that. Time flies when you're having fun. Well, fun. Sometimes you need to make the best out of a bad situation. Right, and it's my duty. We're doing good, important work here. Also, I didn't want to end up living the life my parents wanted for me. I can identify with that. This is so nice. I wish we were sisters. Can we be sisters? You don't have to answer that. Um. Do you have any siblings? I did. Uh, sort of. Long story. You? Oh, lots. Boyfriend! Do you have one of those? We... just broke up. In incredibly bad timing. It's been a difficult few months. I was asleep for a long time. I forgot a lot of the stuff that happened to me before I fell asleep. I tried to remember, but I couldn't, until my memories caught up with me. Oh, Jesus. It's a long story. Very complicated. Maybe another time? Yes, uh, please? There must be something here. So, no luck? Nothing. Sorry, and I've read most of these before. I can't remember coming across any of those words you mentioned. There's not much else to do here in the evenings except read. I don't really have any female friends. It gets lonely. Anyway, I've been through all the encyclopedias and travelogues, but... Nothing about the Purple Mountains or the Ula? Nothing. I mean, the Purple Mountains sounds colloquial. It may have a different name officially, but the Ular... There should be something about them. It's a magical race? They didn't look human. Weird, there's nothing about them. They must be very isolated, or... Or? Or someone's trying to hide something. Which would be weird and very hard to pull off. Forget I said that. I'm on a deadline. I should just cut this short. I guess I'll have to look elsewhere. Oh no! I'm so sorry. I really thought I'd find something. I feel terrible. I Do you want to be my friend? Oh, I already asked you that. I'm coming on too strong, aren't I? I am, I can tell. Stop it, Enu! No, not at all. That's... I'd love to be friends. And thank you for helping me. Much good that did. I really wish I knew who else could... For the love of the festering demon shrimps of Jaharva, do I have to do everything in this place? I didn't spend all those years living on the streets of Mercuria, pilfering food and liberating fat purses to deal with this shite. I swear I'd be better off going back to sleeping in Abnaxus's stone tree... I can't even get a mattress that isn't flea and maggot infested. 
Do your bleeding jobs, people. Is that too much to ask? That guy looks familiar, but I'm not quite sure where I... <gasps> Blind Bob? Eh? What? Who's asking? Well, blessed be me straight britches. You're the lass what brought me mulled wine back when I'd hit rock bottom in Mercuria. What in the name of the eight-hide octo-god of Tartillus are you doing here? I was about to ask you the same thing. Except for, you know, uh, not... Not those words, exactly. Oh, I left me life of beggaring behind. Cleaned myself up. Joined the resistance. I'm a general now. I'm making a difference. He was theoretic. I just can't imagine how the blind general... Didn't he just mention Abnaxus? Do you know someone called Abnaxus? Abnaxus? Now, there's a name I haven't heard spoken in years. Where do you know it from? Sorry, I just overheard... Actually, I met Abnaxus recently. Well, I dreamed about Abnaxus. Or maybe it was more like a vision. This sounds crazy, I know, but... Sounds completely sane to me, lass. Abnaxus turning up in visions? Hmm? That's exactly the sort of fellow he was. Persistent. Unpredictable. And not a little annoying. I met him when he was the Venar ambassador to Irid. Uh, this was before the gutters, when I was still a dapper chap on the Mercurian party circuit. We hit it off, especially seeing as I was going blind, theoretically, and he saw everything. Past, present, and future. Years later, as he was leaving town, he entrusted me with the key to his home. Said to take care of it. I'd sleep there from time to time. Very uncomfortable buck. Musty smell of ancient books and foreign weeds. I didn't much care for it, to be honest. General, I'm sure it's a long shot, but... You said something about a key to Abnaxus's house. They called it the abode back then. Abnaxus's abode. Primitive accommodations, but luxurious location. Prime real estate. Central, with a garden view. Very quiet at night. And the key? D do you still have it? Sorry, this is really important. Oh, I, I carry it with me every day. After all, it is a magic key. Figured it might do me lumbago some good. W what about this house? I mean, the abode? Ah, also still there, and not hard to find. Sits right circle in the center of the city green. Abnaxus carved it out of a petrified tree with his own morbidly huge hands. A few years ago, the authorities turned it into an historical landmark. Of course, no one can get inside on account of the Venar magic. Not without the key, at least. This key? Can I... Oh, sure. Heavier than it looks, ain't it? Hmm? More powerful than iron. Worth its weight in precious stones, and then some. This magic goes back to the first magic. None of that modern hocus-pocus. You feel it in your fingers when you hold it. Tingles, don't it? It does. Sorry, I know this is asking a lot, but can I... Borrow it? Why? Why not? It's done the lumbago no good. And I don't have much use for the place. Now that I've a proper bug here. But keep it safe. Abnaxus left most of his belongings behind and entrusted me with their care. I'd hate to betray that trust. I promise. You spoke with the General. Did you find what you were looking for? It's a step in the right direction. Good. I've asked them to ready a boat for you. Whenever you're ready, it will take you into the city. I may not fully understand your role, Zoe, but there's something about you that... 
I've learned to have faith in the balance. The balance provides. The balance guides. It's guiding you now. You must let it take you wherever it leads, like a leaf on a river. Bend to its will. I'll try. We shall speak again, Zoe Castillo. When the winds have quieted, the clouds have parted, and the grass on the Great Plain stands straight and tall once more. Equipment-wise, the Azadi are definitely winning, but righteousness counts for a lot. Now, I need to find the city green. I wish Crow was with me. I feel less alone with that silly bird around. You're back! And your head's still on! Did you swim? Swim? No, boat. I boated. I mean, they dropped me off, in a boat. Impressive. So, what's the next step on our grand adventure? Tea and biscuits? A hearty nap, perhaps? I need to find the city green and the home of Abnaxus. I visit the city green every day to clean my feathers in the fountain. Follow me. I really wish you had wings. So do I, Crow. Hey, are you okay? Sure, why wouldn't I be? I mean, April and... Of course I'm not okay, okay? But I'm okay. I'll be okay. It's okay. We're okay. Don't worry about it, okay? Okay. She's not the first friend I've lost, and she won't be the last. You learn to roll with the punches. It's either that or... Punch back. Real... Hard. So, how's business? Uh, pretty good. I mean, reaping's a great time for me, with plenty of customers. I must admit that I'm getting rather... No, that makes no sense. How's your memory coming along? Do you remember anything about this place now? I worked so hard to remember, but... No, not much. It was winter. True. Winter changes everything, what with the snow and the ice and all. And the city looked different. Smaller. It probably has grown a bit. But no, I don't really remember anything at all. Perfectly fine. I also remember very little, but then I am a bird with a bird brain.